Private beaches, beautiful sunsets, barbecues and endless summers. Could you live this lifestyle? Let us know in the comments. We've arrived in the beautiful island of Martinique in the Caribbean. Join us as we start to explore. We're here in St Anne's Bay in Martinique. The reason for coming here was because of Gus. If you've got a dog, then one of the easiest places to check in when you come across to the Caribbean are the French islands. Check-in overall was really easy. It took us five minutes and cost us five pound and you can do it in lots of different places. Fuel stations, at the marina and in cafes. Cheers, Ron. <laughs> yeah, that's the guy that bought it for us. <laughs> Cheers well, guys, congratulations! Well done. Well, a successful well, Atlantic crossing. Yes, yes very we successful. Thought, we thought Stephen and I knew what they were doing and they thought we knew what we were doing. And nobody knew what and they were doing. And nobody did. did. <laughs> now, when we compare it not, we're glad we made it. <laughs> done, well done well, all of us. Cheers. Yeah, cheers. cheers. <laughs> we're selling the southern hemisphere. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you Ron, Pauline and Bonnie. <laughs> Yeah. Steve's uh, doing a repair on the dinghy which was leaking quite badly so much so that we were in about three inches of water yeah, so I peeled all this up cleaned it all cleaned all the aluminium abraded it acetoned it and we didn't film it. any of it did we didn't film any of it phone me mate or well, my mate phoned me from the UK port and he's done a load of this work and he said oh yeah what, what are you going to push it down with I said oh, oh the end of a screwdriver he said oh have you got a decent size um, spoon he said you can use the back of a spoon he said it'll really work it in work it in yeah yeah and it did it did a fantastic job what he forgot to tell me was as you're working it in it creates friction and burns your finger on the inside of the spoon <laughs> fantastic job but i now got two fingers that hurt thanks paul is that the river filth over there they've caused the bloody river filth oh they've got our bread Oh my god, you are an absolute <laughs> darling. Thank you very much. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. And what incident have you caused over yeah, there? We see the police lights. lights. Oh, yeah, I thought that. Yeah, yeah. Well, There's that. an ambulance waiting for you. We're Steve and Annette, and with our little pooch Gus, we live on our Venus 46 catch. Our life is simple. We are going to sell as far as we can for as long as we can, and we want to share it all with you. Sarah and Enrique very kindly offered to take us to the shop to uh, get our provisions. Obviously, having just done the Atlantic, uh, we didn't have any fresh food on the boat at all, um, and our dinghy was upside down being repaired. Unfortunately, we didn't realise quite how far it was and quite how wet we were going to get. I'm going to have to find a shop by a top. I can't go in the shop like this. Then it's to me out. Oh, no, it's You haven't seen it. <laughs> a minute. A I think we, why are we going right over there to walk round to here? Yeah, it's not just do as you're told, okay? But as you're told. We could park up over here and just walk to yeah, over yeah. here. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, let's do that then. Yeah. It's amazingly warm. <laughs> Great weather for sailing in. Great weather. What are we doing? We're doing four and a half knots. Forgot to tell you all today that this, this afternoon I had an apology from Steve because he's been a nasty old man today. Uh, uh, let's not go that far. I might have been nasty, but I wasn't an old man. Oh, okay, you were nasty, nasty today. I don't know why. You're... Oh, 
Gus, you've got my uh, uh, glasses uh, round your tail. Come here. <laughs> and, and I've got my comeuppance because I beat myself to death with my own sheet. Yeah, you did. Through my... Stupidity. Pig ignorance and stupidity. Yeah. When I know better. Anyway, we're somewhere beautiful. Look at this. Probably going to get a very nice sunset tonight. Yeah. Just stunning. We're going to go and see if we can find turtles. Apparently there are turtles in this bay, so we're going to go and hunt them out. See if we can land over here and let Gus have a little run around on this little beach here. It's not very big. Gus, don't you jump yeah, yet. Not a very big beach, Gus, is it? Go on in. Go on in. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> It's our own little beach! <laughs> first one! The first one! <laughs> it's our very first beach, our all alone beach, our own beach that we can run around in on. Hey Gus, you haven't had a run around in weeks without a lead, have you? He says, I love doing this. Piece of coral I found on the beach. you've enjoyed our intro into our Caribbean life. The Endless Summer Life continues next week when we enjoy Carnival Week and explore Inner Martinique. Thanks everybody for watching. Don't forget if you've enjoyed it to give us a like and leave us a comment. We love to hear from you.